Hi everyone and welcome back to another video of SNIS. Here dear parents and all my lovely children, we are going to present a small video which is going to help you how to convert any image into a PDF. Uh, since the uh, online tests have begun, we have observed that many parents are facing a bit of problem converting an image to a PDF. We have observed that they are logging out of the online class and then they are converting into a PDF, which we need not do parents. So this video mainly is going to help you without logging out of the online class, you can convert any image into a PDF and send it directly into the respective WhatsApp group. So here we present it. All right. So parents, I will be writing the steps as well. And you can also see the video presentation as to how you can convert any image into a PDF. Yes, dear parents, I will begin. But before that, to help you, we will also be sending the link of the app which you need to install before doing this process. Once again, I repeat, you need to install the app. The app link is available in the description box. Yes, the app link is available in the description box, which will help you to download the app. With the help of this app, you can easily convert n number of images to a PDF. Yes, parents, here I begin the steps. Yes, dear parents, now I will be starting up with the steps. The very first step is you do not have to log out of the online class and you just need to press the online uh, the middle button. The middle button you need to press. As soon as you press the middle button, the next step it will take you to the main screen. In the main screen, you have to the third step what you have to do is you have to open the camera. Okay? And the next thing what you have to do is take the pics of the pages where the child has written the test. If the child has written the test in a single page, it's fine. If the child has written in more than single page, that is two pages or three pages, take the images of all the pages. All right. Yes. Now, after taking the image, now again, you have to go to the app which you have already installed in your phone. Open the app. As soon as you open the app, you see a new page opens. Yes. And on the right top corner of the page, you see a image page. See, you can also see on the uh, video where the description is being shown. Please follow the video as well. Okay. You see the image page. Now you need to click on the image. The next step is you have to click on the image. As soon as you click on the image, it will directly take you to your photos or your gallery. So if you are in the photos or the gallery, you have to choose the option camera. In the camera there, you open the camera. The next step what you have to do is you have to choose the pages, the test pages that you want to convert to PDF. So if your child has written for two pages, select the two pages. If the child has written for three pages, select the three pages as well. So as soon as you select all the three pages, give a OK. As soon as you give a OK, you again go back directly. It will take you back to the PDF, uh, the app where you had opened. All right. Now here. Again, a new page opens, which is the main screen where you have selected all the pages. Below, it says convert to PDF. So now you have to click on that convert to PDF. So it will automatically convert all the pages to PDF. Now, as soon as it converts, it will ask you to rename it. So you have to rename the file, dear parents. This is very, very important. So in the rename, you have to enter your child's name, the class, the section, 
whether UT number one or UT number two or whether UT number three and the subject. I repeat parents, you have to rename the file by giving your child's name, class, section, UT number and the subject. Then the very next step you will see there itself, it says save or done. You can save this file or you can click on the done button. Again a small window opens. That would be the next step. A small window opens. On this small window, you can see share option directly. So there you click on the share option and it will show you where you want to share. Share this file directly to your respective WhatsApp group. I repeat, share it directly to your respective WhatsApp group. So logging into the class without logging out of the class, you have shared the file directly to the WhatsApp group. The teacher would have received this PDF file. This is all what you have to do dear parents without logging out from the class. Yes, I hope my dear children and my dear parents, this video is helpful to you as to how to convert any image to a PDF. You can also see the description here which has been displaying along with the explanation. I hope I was helpful. Thank you for watching this video and do subscribe our channel and do like it.